So today when Dan gets up to read the Bible before he preaches, he's going to be preaching on 1 Peter chapter 2, verses 1 to 10. And so within that falls the memory verse that we're trying to learn. And I'm still trying to learn it too, so we might do some learning together. Are you still trying to learn it? Yes. All right. Very long. So we might start with some numbers. Everybody give me a one for one, Peter. Oh, I'm very loud. One, Peter, chapter two. And today we're focusing, we're going to do the first half, verse nine. So one, Peter, chapter two, verse nine. That's tricky in itself before you even get to the words. All right, and then we've got the first line and we're trying to break it down into some actions that we might remember so we've got but you are a chosen race so you're going to go like this but you are a chosen and race doesn't really mean this but to help us remember it we're going to go like this for a race but you are a chosen race i always get a bit of exercise when i do the the memory verse a royal priesthood so put your crown on a royal priesthood so you are a chosen race a royal priesthood. Cool. Next one. A holy nation. So from our last memory verse, we did this for nation. So we're going to do that again. A holy nation. That's just a given. Anyone that does a memory verse, this is nation in our church. A people for his possession. So we're going to go a people for his possession. It's like he's taking us. He owns us a possession. A people for his possession so that you may proclaim. So that's so you proclaim. Like you're telling everybody. So that you may proclaim. What's next? The praises. We did this for praises. So that you may proclaim the praises like that. You're praising God. And then we go to the one. That's pretty easy. Surely you can remember that. The one. The one who called, I'm going to do that again, who called you, and then this is darkness, out of darkness, because it's dark under here, out of darkness, into the marvellous light, because it's marvellous. All right, let's stand up. Everyone can stand up if you wish. This is when it gets tricky. You can do some helping now, Mum. All right, up on the... Ali, can you slide us? Thank you. There it is. That's a cheat sheet. All right. Everybody, let's go. 1 Peter chapter 2, verse 9. But you are a chosen race, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a people for his possession, so that you may proclaim the praises of the one who called you out of darkness into his marvellous light. You actually all do look pretty marvellous doing that. <laughs> all right, next slide. <coughs> Whoa, we'll get a bit tricky. All right, can we do it? Are you ready? Okay. 1 Peter chapter 2 verse 9. But you are a chosen race, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a people for his possession, so that you may proclaim the praises of the one who called you out of darkness into his marvellous light. Next slide. Okay, all right. I might not have a voice left. I might swap you in a minute. Um, 1 Peter chapter 2, verse 9. But you are a chosen race, a royal priesthood, a pe holy nation, so I forgot that one, a people for his possession, so that you may proclaim the praises of the one who called you out of darkness into his marvellous light. <coughs> Next one. Okay. Oh, this might be the last one. Do I need 
touch it? Oh, do I need to put the microphone because they might do it by themselves? I might do the actions if I can remember. Oh, no, there's no No, no, that, that one's going to disappear. Get rid of that one. Oh, all right, Ali, so just, yeah, that's fabulous. Thank you. All right, ready? going to pray now so I would like I will say something I will say a little sentence and you will repeat it do you think you can do that yes. okay let's go and a good thing to do is actually shut your eyes it doesn't say to do that in the Bible but it helps us not be distracted and put your hands either together or on your lap all right so you haven't got the fidgets Let's go. Dear Lord, thank you for your Bible, your word. Thank you for your Bible, your word. Help us to read your word every day. Help us to read your word every day. So that we can learn more about you. So that we can learn more about you. And show and tell Others how, great you are. Others, how great you are. Amen.